Hi guys, let's have a look at Life After Salim by Lil Nas X. We got the keeper on fret 3 to make the course as easy as possible. I have made detailed lessons on every single song from his new album. Check it out, it's out there in my channel playlist. 1, 2, 3. Now the first chords are A minor, which is mute open, second, second, first open. Then we have a F, but this is more of like a different F major chord which I'm playing. I'm having 1 on E, 3 on A, 2nd on D. Yes, let's keep that. So that much. After that we have an E major chord which is 0, 2, 2, 1, 0, 0. We also have an E7 which is open, 2nd, open, 1st, open, open. Now hold the A minor chord and you do one damn stroke which mainly strums the A, D, G strings. Like this, right? So you got more of like one power chord feeling. So we have go to F and then you go to E7 and strum slowly till the B string. Or at least try to strum till the G string. And after that you do another damn stroke which is a bit quicker. Then you do an up stroke on the E7 chord. And then you strum the A minor chord. And there the riff ends. So we got. See that? So A minor down, F down, E7 down, E7. So make sure after the E7 chord you go to the A minor, it actually resolves beautifully. So we got see how I get the power chord fading. And that's the whole song. If you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? Subscribe, it's gonna be helping me a lot as well as you. Bye.